फोर्स ट्रांसफॉर्मेशन क्वेश्चन कन्वर्ट द सर्किट शोन इन फिगर इन टू अ सिंगल वोल्टेज सोर्स इन सीरीज विथ रेजिस्टन्स वी हैव टू कन्वर्ट दिस सर्किट इन टू अ सिंगल वोल्टेज सोर्स इन सीरीज विथ रेजिस्टन्स यूजिंग सोर्स ट्रांसफॉर्मेशन टेक्निक सल्यूशन फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी विल कन्वर्ट दिस फिफ्टी वोल्ट वोल्टेज सोर्स इन टू इट्स इक्वीवेलेंट करंट सोर्स तो स्टेप नंबर वन कन्वर्ट फिफ्टी वोल्ट वोल्टेज सोर्स टू करंट सोर्स नाउ हेयर वी कैन सी करंटली दिस फिफ्टी वोल्ट वोल्टेज सोर्स इज इन सीरीज विद दिस फाइव होम Now, when we convert this 50 volt voltage source to current source, that time it will be in parallel with this 5 ohm. So it will be first we will draw the current source in parallel with this 5 ohm. Now the direction of this current source will be according to the polarity of this voltage source. Here, the positive is upside and negative is on downside. So it will be. This will be the direction for the current source. Now, according to Ohm's law, current I is equal to V by R. The value of voltage is 50, and the value of resistance is 5. So, this will be of 10 ampere. This current source value will be 10 ampere. Now, we will erase this voltage source. Then, next is. we will convert this 10 volt voltage source into its equivalent current source first we will copy this and second step will be convert 10 volt this 10 volt this 10 volt voltage source to current source now if we convert this 10 volt voltage source to current source then again there will be a current source in parallel with this resistance and the direction of this current source will be according to this voltage source here the polarity is like this the positive is on upper side so the direction of this current source will be like this and according to ohms law i is equal to v by r the value of voltage is 10 and the value of resistance is 3 so this will be let's write as it is 10 by 3 ampere so it will be of 10 by 3 ampere and we will erase this voltage source now then next is here we can see this 2 ohm and 3 ohm are connected in parallel also this 5 ohm is in parallel so first we will solve resistances solve resistances in parallel so here this 5 ohm and 2 ohm and 3 ohm these are connected in parallel so we can write 1 upon r eq is equal to 1 upon 5 plus 1 upon 2 plus 1 upon 3 so this will be 1 upon 5 plus 1 upon 2 plus 1 upon 3 so it is 31 by 30 31 by 30 so therefore r eq is equal to 30 upon 31 since it is a resistance so its unit will be ohm now we will erase all the resistances and we will keep a single resistor of 30 upon 
थर्टी अपॉन थर्टी वन ओ होम थर्टी डिवाइडेड बाई थर्टी वन ओ होम ना नेक्स्ट स्टेप इज हेर वी कैन सी दिस करंट सोर्स दिस करंट सोर्सेस आर इन पैरल सो अवर नेक्स्ट स्टेप विल बी स्टेप नंबर फोर सॉल्व करंट सोर्सेस करंट सोर्सेस इन पैरल Now here this 10 ampere and this 10 ampere and this 10 by 3 ampere. The direction of all the three sources are same. That is upward. So our resultant current source will be upward. It is in parallel with resistance. The resistance value remain same. That is 30 upon थर्टी डिवाइडेड बाय थर्टी वन ओ होम कैन यू रेज दिस नाउ दिस विल बी टेन प्लस टेन प्लस टेन बाय थ्री दिस विल बी ऑफ टेन प्लस टेन प्लस टेन बाय थ्री So ten plus ten plus ten by three will be ten plus ten plus ten by three. It will be of seventy by three. We can write so it will be of seventy by three ampere. Now we will convert this current source into its equivalent voltage source. So our next step, step number five, will be. convert current source to voltage source now again we will copy this or we can directly draw the circuit first here this will be a resistor or there will be a voltage source the polarity of this voltage source will be let's say we will take this is positive and this is negative because here the direction is like this the current is entering at this resistor so here this will be positive and the resistance value is 30 upon 31 so 30 upon 31 we can write 30 divided by 31 it is 0. Nine six zero point nine six ohm, and this voltage will be according to Ohm's law. V is equal to I into R. The value of current is seventy by three. Seventy by three multiplied by resistance value is thirty upon thirty one. Thirty upon thirty one. So this will be seventy by three. Multiplied by thirty upon thirty one, so it is twenty two point fifty eight. Twenty two point fifty eight, and since it is a voltage source, so its unit will be volts. So this is our final circuit. This is our final circuit. A voltage source in series with resistance. This is what we have asked in question. We have to convert this circuit into single voltage source in series with resistance.